are you guys doing? Let's get to it. Well, I had life you heard like I had spent five thousand dollars to go to GrowthCon 4 in Vegas. Watch Magic Johnson, he's a billionaire. Watch uh Grant Cardone, he's a billionaire with most owes over four thousand units. Also, it's gonna be Kevin Hart, he's like that comedian, the black comedian that you like you said, we don't need another black comedian. Well, He's in Jumanji, that movie that made 500 millions. What they all show is that you just got to be persistent. Magic Johnson, remember all this? You don't remember the time AIDS? You were like an outcast. Remember when back in 95, and Magic Johnson said he had AIDS? And there was a time the athletes, they were afraid if they scratched him, they would get um, AIDS and stuff. And I look at it now. He's a billionaire, part owner of the Dodgers, was a part owner of the um los angeles lakers before he sold to do other business ventures and i think he also sold it when he became coach but what that shows you is you just got to keep going they remember a time they're black people I, I couldn't even drink out of a water fountain there are times where you would never think of having a woman as a, 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 a charge of an organization remember there was a time even gay people like got discriminated against so what that tells you is you just got to be persistent. You just got to keep following through. You got to be like the, the almost be like that hard-headed dog that keeps pissing on the carpet. You come slap him in the face. The dog looks at you with those pretty eyes and then does it again. Does it again. So finally you say, fine, let that be the spot that you piss in. But just don't, speak, don't do it in any other spots. So the reason why I spent that money, my goal is to get up to 1. Million, 1. 1.1 million to... 1.5 million with the business. I had spent $2,500 for a ticket last month and I was able to make about 135,000. So this year I'm going for the 1.1 million. Just think, all I need is enough. If I can just get close, I have a student loan of 34,789 I gotta pay off. I also have, I'm gonna, you can track, I'm gonna work a few to pay off my car loan in 24 months. Right now my car loan balance is about $10,800. And I pay at least, at least 400 and then like 380 usually goes toward the principal because I'm trying to pay enough. So at the end of the year, I've made like one or two payments. So that's one reason I'm going to this. But also, I'm like, like now is the time to attack. I mean, never in my time, I didn't think they're like, you just not, like, there's like so many few people with money. If I can only just influence the people with money and get in with them, learn what they do and say, hey, what can I do to keep your business going? That's fine, because I I can't hang around people who are at my income level because they, they they don't they need to, they don't they don't want, they don't have that drive. It's like it's like me going to a, like not that I like the you know I like to pick on you for film and film center people, but as I said, what can I possibly learn from a picker? I was a picker thirty years ago. Thirty years ago, I didn't wear glasses, goggles, a vest, have a line on the ground. That's the biggest, that's the, I mean, that's the only thing since Obama and Trump, all you have is a bunch of warehouses. I mean, I just remember warehouses used to be child molesters, criminals, people out of jail, dropouts. And that's all you have. I have like all oh, these warehouses and I, I well, I love to do this. I like driving by them. I like seeing these Beamers, Audis, these old Mercedes, you guys know, have. I mean, going to a warehouse, man, you're only making $14, $15 an hour. So what does that mean? Unless you're married and you're just kind of helping out with the family expenses, I mean, you gotta be even living at home or you gotta, hopefully if you're driving a nice car, the middle of the class car is a luxury car, you're at least living with roommates. Please don't be someone who wants to have a Mercedes or Audi and you live at home. That's just embarrassing. But I mean, you basically like, unfortunately I, I take responsibility. Like I'm trying to get out there where I provide real jobs I mean, basically, you just have a generation of people who just know how to have enough money to pay for their car, which is probably where some of them are living, and maybe a little fun money, but they don't get any experience living in our own apartment, don't have enough money to go out and just make make a play or do something, man. All they know is how to have fun, unfortunately. We've got a generation of kids just have fun. That's why all the rich people, kids, all the kids of money, they're going to eventually be the ones telling the person who has no money what to do because you're not hanging around people with juice, man. They don't, you don't know how to relate to the people with money. That's why I'm going to this thing. If I can take $5,000, if I can just learn 100000 dollars 300000 
five million five hundred thousand dollars worth of information to help me that's priceless man especially now especially with this aging population you have all the people hey i just want somebody to help me keep my money martin can you help me keep my money or martin i just want you to help me sell it's got to learn how to sell now it's all about sales now man uh, unfortunately we messed up and like with all the global economy and stuff it's not like it used to be when i was older where you actually had companies produce things and ship stuff out very few things very few businesses now so fortunately you have a consumer based society and you just have to know how to sell like basically negotiate and influence with people so i'm going to this growth con thing also to get me some skills to help me pay off my car loan this month man i'm sick of paying off this i'm sick of car loans i don't care if it's forty thousand dollars i don't care if i have thirty thousand dollars i'm just sick of car loans and what else can you help me do let me give him my student loan hey man just give me like an extra thousand two thousand dollars a month where i can make a play man i can tell my baby let's go out and party we don't worry about going to Holiday Inn, La Quinta Inn, these, these, these rickety raggedy places. Honey, let's go big time. That's what I want. And especially if you're an older guy and you want to date these young girls, I got to bring the money in, man. The young girls said, bro, what you doing? You can't help me as a picker. What, I need, I, you need to bring some home, some to mama. I'm a nice Asian, white girl, good looking, Hispanic, mamacita. It's like, come on, bro, you got to bring the money. Or what can you do to help me with my career, man? Just don't be like one of these darky guys in the gym with his girlfriend with his earphones looking at his phone trying to like, oh, I, I, the girl don't want to talk to the guy anyway. So she he, she loves it when he puts the earphones in and plays with his phone. She's like, I want to get rid of this guy, man. She, but she probably made the mistake. Oh, let's just live together and like split the rent. Don't ever, don't ever, I've done it three times. Don't ever move in with your girlfriend. You never split the rent. In the end, you end up hating a person. So it's better to marry them 50-50 than to just be a boyfriend or girlfriend and do some type of bizarre stuff like that. Doesn't work, man. So if you're going to live, if you're going to have your woman live with her or you're going to have your man live with you, just say, hey, I'll pay all the rent. Then when I'm sick of you, you just get out or I get out one of the two. Just don't put both your names on the lease thinking, hey, we're going to do 50-50. Doesn't exist. That's why I also go to these these fairs to help me see what let me see what a good couple can do or if someone who's broken up like why did they get out of that relationship? What was her what he or she not doing? So as we head for the growth con day one, I'm gonna let you know why I'm going to growth con. I just want to make a play, man. I want that extra money. And I and I realize to make money you gotta spend money. Nobody's gonna help somebody who's broke. Look at all the homeless people on the corner. Ain't nobody gonna help them. Christmas is over. Now they're going to get kicked like the dog on the street. Like I tell you, when you find out you're just save, saving all your money for one time a year, it's not cutting it, man. So basically, this is day one of counting down to Growth Con. I'm going to be in Vegas February 20th, 24th, 23rd. Yep, I'll have an offer for you. I'm going to have an offer for you soon. But first, let's just build it up. Let me just build your belief like, hey, you need to spend money to make money. You pay off your car loan, man. Pay off those credit cards. Unless you have a way to write it off, you can't write it off, just get rid of it. So today is day one of Countdown to Growth Con. And today as we head to Vegas is, why do you have, do you want to have extra money? What would you do after some money? Subscribe, subscribe and comment below. Do you have an extra 100 to $500 on you right now? I do. What about you? 76% of Americans are living paycheck to paycheck. They don't have money right now. They're broke, man. They're going back to work January 6th. What about January 1st to January 6th, man? Just think, 69% of companies are breaking even or losing money. How many of those companies that these people have come back to today are about to close their doors? They, are, they lost a week worth of income. You know why? Because they don't know how to sell. That's why I'm going to this conference. I need to know how to sell. I need to know how to make people make money. Stick with me. We're going to do the journey together. And I'm going to show you how to pay off your car loan in 24 months because I'm going to use myself as an example. Today, my car loan is down to $10,800. Let's see if we can't get it down to $10,600 by next month.